If you remember, we saw many videos made by the Mohammedans like Mimi Hijab and Lili Dawa and her sisters, who they speak about jihad and resistance, and yet they are resisting by having getting fatter and getting more Starbucks coffee. Uh, so while the Israeli are like an, uh, Netanyahu announced that they killed already more than 20,000 Hamas terrorists. And if we compare the, the loss of the Israeli soldiers, I will say to you that the Israeli lost more. Why? Not because the number, no, the number is very little. I think the Israeli now, they lost, I don't know, 230. I'm not sure the number. You can check it out up today. But that number is way more valuable than all the 20,000 coward rat criminals of Hamas. This is why I say that, uh, uh, you know, the Israeli lost more. Uh, but here in this uh, video, you know, we always we see the Israeli going inside the Palestinian towns, if we can call them Palestinian, the Arab uh, towns, not Palestinians. And they capture the terrorists, they bring them from the heart of terrorists. Uh, 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 I mean, you will find like a 200 terrorists and they have very heavy duty uh, machine guns. Yet the Israeli are able to go inside, deep inside the town and conquer them. And today is no exception. If we look here, you will see in this, uh, uh, I call it a surgery, because they went inside the city of Rafah, which is a terrorist territory, heavy duty. In fact, this is the only territory where Hamas are heavily located and they have they are not touched yet. Uh, so they enter there. And then, you know, this is remind me of the old days when the Israeli used to go to, uh, they went all the way to Lebanon and they captured the assistance of Hezbollah, the, the, the biggest uh, top head, the second guy. They went down in the ground, they captured the guy, they have even with them dogs. They walk in the street, in the highway uh, 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 of uh, uh, the south of Beirut, uh, before the airport, and they capture the guy, they capture his uh, bodyguards, and not even one like member of Hezbollah appear to defend or to shoot at the Israeli. After the Israeli left, Suddenly, all those Hezbollah, they came in the street and they start shooting at the air. But for more than 30 minutes, when the Israeli, they were down on the ground, not only they captured the guy, they capture and they start searching. Well, nobody knows really what they were searching for, but they capture all those guys and they were searching around in the area. And then they go in their helicopter and they lift and not a single bullet was shot at them. Today is the same. Those cowards, Hamas, they are the same as the coward of Hezbollah. The difference between them, one is Sunni, this is Hamas, and one is Shia. But both of them, in fact, they are dogs of Iran. Today, the IDF and the intelligence, the Shin Bet, they went inside Rafah, the heart of the, the headquarter of Hamas, and they were able to free two old men hostages. Shame on them to capture someone at the age of 60. But how you can tell people of no shame, what is shame? What you expect? Shame for religion, shame for a prophet, and shame for terrorist. <laughs> Those the Israeli forces <laughs> going in the and they are the the video is very short. So, sorry, I wish I can show you more, but this is what they have. Thank you very much for watching, and see you soon later again. <laughs>